Thank you all for tuning in. Alrighty, alrighty. I'm whispering really quiet because this morning there was a little fawn over here and it was laying in a whole rotted out stump and we're going to see if it's still there. So come along and let's see. See that stump right there? This morning there was a little fawn in there. Anthony, my son, seen it and stayed away from it, stayed at a distance, but we got a picture of it. So we'll show you. So the mother must have came back and got it this morning. When you see him like that, you don't want to disturb him. You want to stay at a distance. Because if you were to touch him and the mother smells your scent on him, the chances of her coming back isn't good to maybe not. So if you ever see a little fawn, never pet it unless you absolutely have to. Like if it got cold defense and you have to release it. And if you have rubber gloves on, put rubber gloves on. But anyway, what could be more cuter than a little fawn laying in a stone? today what a beautiful day it is beautiful beautiful weekend for memorial weekend and i want to wish everybody a happy and safe memorial weekend and god bless our country and especially god bless our vets i want to show you a little chickadee nest over here it is so cute and it used to, it's just a stump here and it used to be a tree and i used to have a um bird's nest up there and I would get bluebirds in there I get nut hatchers in there and I would get um, these little chickadees in there so I guess this is the continue even after the trees down they're still coming back and looking for that box but obvious the trees not there just the stump but come on over I want to show you this This little hole right here is her nest. So come on over and let's look and see if we can see those little chickadees down in here. The only thing I worry about is nothing gets it because it's down low to the ground. Come on over. Look. Come on, everybody. Come on. Guess what? She is gone. Everything's gone. All right. Well, my son Anthony has a picture of them, so I'll have to show you. There you go. Hello. Hey man, how do you like my cool glasses? I just got them at Rite Aid. Let me get my hat on her. Get her now. <laughs> I'm just taking it easy out here. Oh, that's oh, she's got my glasses. Hey, come back here. <laughs> She's showing her glasses off to everybody. Hey girl, I want them back. When you're out here working around the farm, you come a lot, you come across a lot of nice nature, like the deer and the little chickadee. Well, come on over. I was weed eating in here and there's a mess of little baby rabbits. So I stopped weed eating, naturally I don't want to hit them, but I'm also gonna leave the grass there so the hawks and the foxes don't see them as easy because they're hiding in there. But come on over and look at them. Yeah, now watch, I can't find them. Okay, there's one right there. Look how cute that is. Ready? Let's see if he stays there. Look how cute. Look at that. Ain't that cute? Okay, got one there. That is so cute. Yeah, he's going. I'm, he's going to run over there. There's about at least four or five. There's a, probably at least four in here. But like I said, I'm going to leave this girl up for him. Oh, here's one. And that's oh, I think it's the same one. But here, get another shot of him. See how cute he is. All right, and I'm going to leave this all grow up until they are gone. And it won't be long before they go. This way they're protected in there. All right, I just wanted to show you what we come across in the field. It's really nice to be out with nature and seeing nature. All right, I want to thank you all for tuning in and watching. And just remember, be someone important. Be yourself. To 
next time. God bless you. See you.